Christmas art journal page which hopefully will get you in the mood for Christmas. It certainly worked for me. So I'm trying out a little bit of a new technique with this art journal video and I'm going to have a mixture of music and uh, voiceover. So I hope you like it. Let me know what you think. Does it work for you? Uh, I've seen it on other people's videos and I quite like it. So you get nice mood, mood music in the background and a little bit of tuition along the way. So I'm using Distress Paints and uh, this dark blue one is an acrylic paint to blend the background for my art journal page. with some watered down white acrylic paint to create the illusion of snow. One mask created by cutting a circle out of a scrap of paper, a little bit of kitchen roll and some white acrylic paint and then just sponge over the mask to create a mottled surface that looks like a moon. isolate the word snow on these old dictionary pages to use on my snowman so I'm creating the foreground, a whole row of icicles and of course my cute snowman. into place it gives a nice flat finish. down blue acrylic to create some shading on my snowy areas and uh, I suddenly realised actually probably the shading will be on this side because of the position of the moon.
in the wires from the voice of experience because I'm very fond of ruining my pens by not waiting till my paints and glues are dry before I start outlining. So I'm going to give him a nose, some eyes and a beautiful red and white scarf. I'm just using little bits of paper and uh, cutting them out to shape. So just sketching using my original template for my snowman's head, the uh, size and shape of the scarf. background I just felt that it needed some snowflakes so I'm using my snowflake punch to create some falling snow using two sizes of um, litter stamp to create my quote sort of quote I think it's more of them um, some uh, lines from a song let it snow let it snow let it snow and i'm using black archival ink because i will be adding a little bit of shading to these um, quote strips when i put them on my page shading to those little strips of paper just to make them stand out a little bit from the background.
then using some Ranger Distress glitter and some diamond stickles I'm going to put the sparkle onto my snow. I love this um, Distress glitter because it looks very sugary and it's just perfect for uh, just putting that little hint of sparkle onto the snow but then I'm using a little bit of a brighter stickles and I'm going to put some glitz onto my snowflakes just outlining my letters to make them stand out a little bit more and then it's on with the stickles So there you have it, a little bit of Christmas on my art journal page and I hope you've enjoyed it and that it's put you in the Christmas spirit, it certainly has added to mine and I'm looking forward to doing more Christmassy projects over the coming days. Don't forget to let me know what you think about the talking over the musical background, uh, let me know if there's too many tips, not enough tips and uh, you want me to be completely quiet <laughs> I won't be offended and uh, I'd just like to say before uh, the end credits come up where I uh, give you some links to tempt you I will uh, say thank you for watching and hope that your Christmas preparations are coming on and that you're enjoying being crafted this Christmas so here are the links if you want to visit my blog or my Etsy shop or perhaps subscribe if you don't already I'd love to have you join me and also I'm leaving you the links if you want to watch more art journal pages or if you want to watch something that is entirely Christmassy so a couple of Christmas projects on these final links so thank you for watching and see you again soon